Tens of millions are under winter weather alerts on both coasts here in California. Yet another major storm is on the way, while on the other side of the country, they're bracing for a nor'easter. Miguel Almaguer is in Northern California. Miguel, more pain in the forecast. Absolutely, Lester. That's what the forecast says. And while the sun is out here today, these floodwaters have not receded. And now there's rain, a whole lot more of it on the way. Tonight, wading through a sea of mud and muck, the flooded community of Pajaro is cleaning up from the last storm just as the next one barrels in. A 300-foot levee breach near Santa Cruz has left houses underwater, power out, and washed away roads. So even when the waters recede, we don't know how much damage it's done to our, our railroads, to our roads. After more than 200 rescues, this is what authorities fear tomorrow. A second atmospheric river closing in, days after this damage from the first one. The sound of the river is just so loud that it is just frightening. The same central and northern California cities inundated with a foot of rain and in the middle of severe flooding today face another eight inches Tuesday. We've got a lot of shoveling to do. We are too old for this. Almost we just me. cleaned it up from the last flood. As another foot of snow blankets the Sierra, bi-coastal storms have 24 million under winter weather alerts. With up to 18 inches of snow forecasted in parts of New England, a March nor'easter is bringing a mix of rain, sleet, and snow to the northeast. Salt trucks ready in Boston, 8,000 utility workers on standby in New York. This could be deadly. For millions, a winter of misery, and now the threat of another dangerous blow. Miguel Almaguer, NBC News, Monterey County, California. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.